Welcome back to Fox 43 AM Live. We're counting down the days until Festival of Trees. And joining me now is Jessica Hope, design chair for the festival. Good Hi. morning. Good morning, Dane. Welcome back. I think we were talking about you, we were here last year talking was, about last year's Festival yes, of Trees. And I'm I'm so excited. We have grown. We have really? grown. And 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 it's just it is such a delight. I have such a heart and a passion for mm -hmm. the work of SLI, you know, supporting youth, adults, and seniors with intellectual and physical developmental disabilities and, you know, the work they do, making sure that they live full lives, complete lives, they feel supported both emotionally and physically. You know, they, they've, they're given so many opportunities to be involved in the community, to have independent lives. And Festival of Trees is SLI's biggest fundraiser mm -hmm. of the year. And the fact that I get to combine my heart for community and my heart for glitter uh, <laughs> is, is just, it's a dream come true. And, and this year we have 57 entries getting ready for the Festival Forest uh, that opens on November 21st at Fairlawn Plaza. And yeah, it's, I, I couldn't be more delighted at, at all the work our team has mm -hmm. done to bring us this year. It really, like I, I, I've been talking about SLI before and last year it was, it was such a beautiful lineup of trees you had going on. Yes. I'm so excited for this year's lineup. Thank you. And, and again, we are, this year's combination of designers. Mm -hmm. So I am I am design chair, which yes. means I am responsible for not only doing trees myself, but also recruiting people to help design and donate trees and then supporting designers along the way. They are working year round, coming up with concepts, finding the right items, uh, figuring out how they want to actually put the tree together. Mm -hmm. um, it's it's more complicated than you think when you have to transport trees around. I, um, yes, that's what it, I was gonna ask you. Please get into it. it, like, it is. What so, does it so take? Our, our designers work for months to put this together and they're, they're so creative. Uh, and this year's combination is, is a great blend of designers that we've had with us for years. Mm -hmm. Designers who are first time designers who are trying really, really brave com concepts. Uh, I've got one that I know it's, we've definitely got some Barbie and Ken mm -hmm. coming. Uh, 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 yes. Definitely I, I some would, Barbie and Ken coming. I want coming. a whole Barbenheimer uh, tree. <laughs> okay, I thought about it, but I thought, you know, Nuclear war might be too might not be dark the greatest for, for festival. Nuclear winter Christmas. There we go. <laughs> there you go. Um, but but they're, they're so clever. Um, I know we've, we've got international themes. We have student groups. But we also have a lot of designers who are coming back, mm -hmm. who, who we kind of lost you know, their involvement over, over the COVID years. Mm -hmm. And now they're back and joining us in our That's new great. permanent home at Fairlawn Plaza. And, and really, we have a, a bit of a family. Uh, I don't know if you've ever gotten to come to a festival set up day I but it's not. it's uh, over a hundred people filling a hall building Christmas trees <laughs> or, or building wreaths or building uh, we have a whole category that's called trees that aren't trees and it's <laughs> quilts and ladders and balloons and really folks if you're out there and you're thinking you know I'd love to do a tree that was actually a train or I'd love to do a tree we had a tree last year that was made of fishing poles mm -hmm. this year we have a tree that's a tent I love playing with the concept of it because what's so great about how the holidays in Topeka now is we are becoming a holiday destination town. When you think of zoo lights, when you think of Winter Wonderland, mm -hmm. and you think of Festival of Trees, you don't have to travel an hour. You don't have to spend a ton of gas money to go right. out of town. You can have that big, bright, glittery, wonderful, wonderful Christmas time right here in Topeka by making a stop at all three. and. And with the new permanent home at Fairlawn, we now get to have the festival forest up for two weeks. So all that work is is on display and really can become a date night, a family mm -hmm. outing, uh, a great place for photo shoots. Someday, and this is this is just my personal goal, is I'm gonna have like host a holiday like wedding concept. Ooh, and yes, and like have Santa yeah. marry a couple. Mm -hmm. Wouldn't that be amazing? I I'm just saying. Uh, I'm, Laura is so lucky right now that we're already married now. There you go. Sorry, sorry, Laura. We can go renew I, our vows I with tried. Santa Claus. That would be cute. <laughs> Brainstorming right here. So, so yes. So it's an exciting time. Uh, I'm, I'm particularly excited because again, because we now have SLI Connect, our permanent home. Mm -hmm. I actually already have one of my entries done. Which, Impressive. if you remember last year, I was a little stressed out at this time because I was like, I have, I have all these. I don't know how I'm going to get them done. I'm a 
ahead of the game. There you go. This is amazing. Uh, also ahead of the game is we already have our silent auction being mm -hmm. set up. We're going to have over 100 absolutely beautiful baskets. And then we are already setting up for the sweet shop again. Oh, so, I am. Delicious sweet shop. The delicious sweet shop. Uh, everything from, from breads and cookies to, of course, my personal favorite, the pump, the peanut butter balls. Oh, oh, ooh, peanut butter balls. I, I know. Gotta, I got to give me some puppy chow. We went a little nuts over those last mm -hmm. year. Yes. And so also there's the silent auction you got going yes. on, the sweet shop, but yes. also the trees themselves the trees are themselves, open for bidding. They are open for bidding. So, and, and I want to make it clear kind of the distinction. Mm -hmm. From November 21st to December 2nd, 10 to 4 each day, come to Fairlawn Plaza, walk around, enjoy the view, absolutely free. Then all of the trees and wreaths and entries are also up on, we'll have at slifestivaloftrees.com. You can go and you can bid on the trees and the wreaths themselves to take home. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and I'm kind of excited. We have flat starting rates this year. So everything is starting between $100 and $250 and going, going up from there. Oh, yes. But bidding will be open the entire time. So from November 21st to December 2nd. And then, of course, there's the big holiday party. Of course. Uh, the festival soiree on on December 1st mm -hmm. so and I'll be there in in my elf costume. Do they need to get tickets for the soiree? They just do which over? they can okay. also do at slifestivaloftrees.com. All right. It's a great one-stop shop. Oh, Sounds like it's gonna be fun and real quick you know if they win the tree how do they get it? What's that process look like? Okay what we have a great team of volunteers uh, from Seaman High School that's been the key club has been helping us uh, wrap trees for years. So yes, if you if you want to see a miracle, it's watching 57 trees get wrapped up uh, very very quickly. But then we do we do pick up and pay. So you pay for it, and then you literally come to Fairlawn Plaza, and we will help you um, move. It, it looks odd. A, a mm -hmm. Christmas tree that's all wrapped, wrapped up. up. It really does look very odd. It's more Halloween-y than, than holiday-y. Uh, but, but yes, and we will help you get that in the car. If you bid over $750, we will deliver it for you. Ooh, okay. Yes. Worth it right there. It's, 100%. 100%. And then poof, tree, all done. All done. You're done for the year. And also, I guess one more question real fast before questions. we get you out of here. Um, if somebody wants to make a tree for next year, slifestivaloftrees.com and then you get to email me and I will tell you how excited I am to have you join our, our festival family and I will brainstorm with you and I will send you videos that I've made of like how to fill a tree, how to blend uh, ribbon and ornaments and make a tree topper and I'll, I'll talk with you all year about Just making like a tree. That. But yes, I, I really do hope, as much as I love our designers this year, let's recruit some more. So yeah, let's start. get, you know, 107 trees. I, 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 I think don't know, Shannon's Plaza about to pass out this, over there, but, but yes, yes. <laughs> I would love 107 trees. That would just, that would make my year. Wonderful. All right, Jessica, thank you so much for joining us Thanks, this morning. Babe. And of course, everybody, to learn more, you can visit slifestivaloftrees.com.